about uh, about the game on Saturday on the, on the final play there. You know, you, you had the chart, but was there a point where you were thinking pull up right there, or just kind of what what kind of what happened on the, at the very end? Uh, I just tried to make a play. Yeah. Uh, and unfortunately, it didn't go my way. Yeah, so I have for that. Yeah. Okay. I'm um, talking about the game last Saturday. You know, Tyree hits the shot at the end. Kind of what? How happy were you guys for him in that moment? I know Coach Green said he's a guy that loves Georgia and all that kind of stuff. Um, I was ecstatic. I was I was super happy for him. Um, and Tyree, I think he needed that. Um, just knowing him outside the court, um, how strong-willed he is, and um, he's dealt with some adversity. And um, I just felt like that was God's way of saying, "Hey, I still got you. I love you." At the end of the day, I'm gonna do what's best for you. And um, I, I really, I really, I was really happy for him. I really felt like he needed that, um, that extra boost of confidence. Um, I mean, I mean, I was super happy for him. The whole team was happy for him. You can tell by our reactions. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I mean, I was super proud of him. Super happy for him. The adversity you mentioned, that kind of how his whole career has been here, and obviously this year too. You know, how much does that say about him that he sticks through it and he hits a shot in a game y'all really needed to have? Um, it just shows his leadership. I mean, his character, um, his, his belief in the program. Um, how, how committed he is to the program, just how he's a team first guy. Um, he does whatever the coach asks for him. Um, just shows you how much he loves and respects the game, no matter what, what situation you can play him through. He'll, he'll still prevail, um, and he'll still work as hard as anyone you'll ever see. Um, and, and he still always will be prepared to make that next play next man up. And uh, we're all happy that he's our teammate, um, and we're definitely going to miss him and try to um, have him go out with a bang. The work ethic he showed throughout the year, kind of how much have you seen that rub off on the young guys like yourself, Tumani, you know, all you young guys, how much have you tried to take from him? In yeah, that just from day one, just setting that, that standard. Um, being the first one in the gym shooting, being the last one, um, getting extra coach, uh, getting extra reps with coach after after practice, um, and just seeing that, man, it just drives you. Like, hey, he's a senior, he's doing this. I mean, he's just showing us how to be successful. And um, I think the younger guys are starting, especially me, we're all starting to pick up on that and um, and, when, and try to fill that standard. Taking the, the record out of the equation, uh, in what ways can you quantify how this team has matured throughout the course of the season? I'm, so, I'm sorry. Now, how much? I mean, taking the record, y'all's record out of the equation, mm -hmm. how much can you quantify how much the team has matured being so young to right, from the beginning to right now? Um, we're seeing ourselves mature and right in front of us just um, at individually and just seeing our, our, our teammates, um, just the way we're handling games um, and how close we've been. Um, we're winning some games, we're going on a little win streak there, mm -hmm. um, trying to get back right on the winning side. Um, our maturity, uh, as far as like how we're playing, um, mm -hmm. we're, I mean, we're really together right now and I feel like we're in a good place. And um, right now we're just focused on conquering the day. Mm -hmm. um, taking taking advantage of each rep. Now, yeah, and there were a couple of times I know in the Carolina game where they went on had a little runs of like eight zero, seven zero, something like that. But and we made the runs crowd, that's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, but even it, in Vanderbilt. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, why is it happening now? I guess is what I'm, what I'm asking. Yeah, about why is it happening? Just experience. Yeah. I mean, we've had some experience where we were the ones making the runs. We've had some experience where the runs were made on us. Mm -hmm. And um, when we're this deep in the season, I mean, like you said, everyone's maturing. I mean, we've gone through some stuff now. Um, we feel like we're we're not we're no longer like young guys no longer freshmen and the older guys um they're they're teaching us as we're going through this like hey I mean this basketball is a game of runs at the end of the day mm -hmm. um everyone's here at the highest level and we're all good players on both sides so runs are going to be made and um I think we're just we're just finally putting those pieces together where hey we can make this run we can win some games and um you're seeing us gel right now how much confidence does that give y'all now moving forward.